What's up y'all? It's another day out here at CWC and today I'm going to teach you how to do the Moby Dick. The tricks you're gonna need to know how to do to do a Moby Dick are basically just a tantrum and a backside 360. Um, a whirly bird could help, it's not necessary, but it would maybe help a little bit with air awareness. A tantrum a blind, you don't need, it's not really anything similar, so don't really worry about a tantrum a blind if you wanna learn a Moby Dick. With this trick, I'd say take like a medium hardish edge, maybe a little bit harder than your normal tantrum, just so you can have a nice tension to pull yourself around. But yeah, don't do anything too crazy like a raily edge or anything. You don't want to get the handle ripped out of your hands. So yeah, that's the edge you need to take. So yeah, take that medium and hardish edge towards the kicker. You're going to want to ride all the way up the kicker as you normally would on a tantrum. But as you're pushing off the kicker, you're not going to want to flip straight back. You're going to want to take your head and look over your right shoulder while also reaching for the handle as early as possible. So it'll be sort of a tantrum and handle pass early like that, like you would on a normal backside three rotation. So yeah, when taking off the top of the kicker, make sure you just really use that front hand to rip it to your lower back so your back hand can actually get the handle as soon as possible. You're gonna continue doing that same motion where you're looking over your right shoulder. But once the handle is in this other hand and you start flipping, you can just start letting it unwind you. And once you finish that first backside 180 rotation, you're going to need to take this handle and pull as hard as you can to rip it back towards your front hip. If you don't get it into your front hand in time, that's fine. Just make sure you get the handle there so you can finish the full 360 rotation. So yeah, after you've done that first backside 180 degree rotation, it's really easy for you to spot the water right in front of you. So just continue pulling with that hand over to your front hip like you normally do. Spot that landing, bend your knees on impact, and just ride away. It would be nice if you could get the handle into your front hand because that will help you ride away easier. It's not necessary, but it will also open up doors to continue this trick to Moby Dick 540 or anything like that. So yeah, just keep that in mind. So yeah, I'm just gonna give you a quick little summary of the entire trick. Take that medium hardish edge towards the kicker a little bit harder than your normal tantrum. Wait all the way to the top of the kicker to push off of it. Make sure you rip that front hand to your lower back as fast as you can and try to get it into your rear hand as fast as possible. While doing this, make sure you're looking over your rear shoulder to initiate that backside 360 rotation. Once the handle is in your other hand, you can really use that back arm to rip yourself all the way around. Make sure you look down and spot your landing bend your knees on impact and just ride away. That's how you do a Moby Dick. If any of you guys end up trying this trick and you're having some problems, feel free to send me a video of your attempts to my DMs on Instagram or something like that. I'll be sure to reply and help you out with whatever I can. But yeah, if you guys like this video and want to see more tutorials, make sure you go subscribe. Give me a comment what kind of tricks you guys want to learn. And yeah, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.